This is Scotland. Bad weather, kilts galore, accents abound, and regular passenger flights that sometimes take less than a minute. Yup, Logan Air, a Scottish regional airline, operates a flight between two islands that takes less than one minute. If wind conditions are favorable, it can finish the route in just 47 seconds. Why do they operate this? And how much does it cost? This group of islands are called the British Isles. This specific island is called Great Britain. This specific part of Great Britain is called Scotland. This specific part of Scotland is called Orkney, or also the Orkney Islands. It's in the Orkney Islands where this extremely short passenger flight takes place, specifically between these two islands, Westray and Papua Westray. Both of these islands are relatively small and accordingly have small populations. Westray only has a population of 588 people, and Papua Westray only has a population of 90 people. Even though there's under a thousand people living in the two islands, those people still need a way to travel to the outside world. Because it's necessary for the people living on those islands to be able to travel to the outside world, the flight is something called a public service obligation. The government is obligated to provide a means of transport for the people living on the islands. The government, though, doesn't operate the flight. It's subsidized, and the Scottish regional airline Loganair is the one that operates it. Back to the flight. One of the main uses of the flight is its use as a connecting flight that goes to Kirkwall, the biggest city in the Orkney Islands. The airport at Kirkwall then provides flights to Aberdeen, Edinburgh, and Glasgow, which then connects to most major international destinations. The flight is also used to transport medical personnel. With less than a thousand people living on the islands, there aren't many experienced doctors or nurses on the islands. What plane does the route use? It uses a Britain Norman BN2 Islander, a relatively small plane that doesn't seat very many. The Westray Papa Westray Routes Islander can only seat eight. The flight itself is shown on Logan Air's website as taking only two minutes to complete. However, with favorable wind conditions, it can finish the route in 47 seconds. On the Logan Air website, the cost of a ticket starts at 17 pounds, or about 23 US dollars. The flight between Westray and Papa Westray also is under consideration to be switched to an electric plane. Why? Well, the route is only 1.7 miles, which makes it an ideal testing ground for a new electric plane. Logan Air said that they would change the plane to an electric one by 2021, although that hasn't happened yet. So, that's the one minute passenger flight. If you liked the video, then be sure to subscribe and like. If you didn't like the video, then press the dislike button twice, and then for good measure, press the like button. Thank you for watching Explained. New videos, every other Friday.